Hi Aquarius and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you so much for your support, for your donations, likes, comments and subscribes. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. So this is a bonus end of month reading for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. I'm doing these readings for the top six most popular signs in March. Um, and yours was the second most popular, so glad that resonated. So let's see with the Light Seer's Tarot what we get for you today. Okay, so some of you could have been through a breakup or you're healing at the moment. And um, there's a lot of solitary energy coming through here. Yeah, some of you could be focused on the past and what you've lost and you're trying to heal and um, really getting that a lot of healing. So sort of trying to be in your bubble, but there is one energy here that keeps creeping through this person from the past, I feel, that you're focused on. You know, and with the Three of Swords as well, showing healing for some of you, break up potentially. Um I feel that some of you are making a decision. You're kind of at a standstill right now, looking towards your future. Really getting the initials R and C in particular. But with the Ace of Pentacles, um, you know, that's quite beautiful. And that's amazing that the Three of Swords fell over definitely a sign there. Spirit is saying with that, that when you heal your heart chakra, so that's what a lot of you need to do, then you get this beautiful gift from the universe that comes towards you. That could be finances, it could be stability of some sort, could be, you know, a commitment so we're going to put that at the end there. Um, we've got Scorpio and Pisces energy here coming through. So a lot of water. So anything else about this Ace of Pentacles? Wow, Aquarius, um, pretty amazing messages we're getting. So some of you are going to feel quite conflicted um, within this is because some of you have some someone coming towards you. More water here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Um, and Gemini. 
So a very romantic offer um, from someone who, you know, they might bring you a gift um, of some sort. Maybe they, they're a writer for some of them. For some of you, this is a twin flame, so you may have met already. And I feel the conflict is over this decision, because the lovers also indicates a decision, you know, do I stay where I am or do I give this a go? With the fall at the bottom and the ten of cups, wow, Aquarius, beautiful, and the king of cups. So we go from the knight to the king, an upgrade. Um, someone who's very emotional. They may not show everything with you right, right away, um, but they do feel a lot within. Quite a spiritual person. Ten of Cups as well, really indicating Twin Flames here. Um, you might have a family, they might, or you may in the future. And with the full, you know, spirit is just telling you to go for it. Um, here's your heart healed. So same message, spirit is saying when you heal your heart and you sort of let go, then this beautiful gift of love and this connection comes towards you. That is pretty amazing, um, Aquarius, I think. Anything else Aquarius needs to know? Wow, yeah, we're sort of getting the same message. Um, some of you, this was definitely a connection that ended um, and that's where the heartbreak came out there. You thought it was over, but this person has been on your mind. You've sort of been almost like, not waiting, but you've often wondered about this person. You know, been sort of gazing off into the distance, wondering about them, what they're doing, and then in they come. I do feel you could be at a distance from this person. This could certainly um, be reborn, this connection. Yeah, and Ten of Pentacles at the bottom. It's just beautiful, Aquarius. Um, it's a very destined connection, I feel. You have needed to be patient. Again, we've got a lot of family here. So either, as I said, you've already got families, you come together, or you start a family together. Sagittarius and Scorpio energy. Okay, let's um, get a few romance angels. Oops, that just flew on the floor. So we've got true love at the bottom of the deck. So for a lot of you know this within yeah, if you've met them already. You may be receiving signs. Look out for those. Okay, could be in nature. Um, your guides are really trying to sort of um, help you to, to stay positive and have faith. Some of you um, have felt your you sort of don't deserve love with that three of swords needing to heal 
but this is your message and this was your lesson I feel for a lot of you because with twin flames um, if this is the case we often go through these lessons that bring us back together and make us ultimately love ourselves first so just know that Aquarius yeah um, you're being guided to flirt open up um, kind of like I was saying before about that heart letting your heart open up um, and be free and interesting this card says here allow your heart and soul to sing with joy so we're getting a lot around around that sort of healing your heart and then just like letting your heart be free and that then brings in this beautiful passionate connection towards you okay really getting the initial p and f so let's take a few wisdom of the oracle So the first card um, really reminds me of this one about the signs, same thing, um, because this is talking about when you're doing your everyday chores or just working, you may find signs come to you, so pay attention to those signs. Um, you know, it could be anything, it could be things in nature seeing numbers the number here is 42 breaking down to a six the number of love this is just beautiful loyal heart so um like this image here you know a lot of you have been loyal just wondering about this person if they're going to come towards you staying loyal to them I feel and this is a very spiritual connection interesting this is like it's also like the heart um, opening up so we keep getting that message letting your heart open and this love comes in seems to be the main theme for you in this reading Aquarius and know that you are blessed, the stars are aligning, this connection is very blessed, 22, master number. Um, you may be seeing double numbers, that could also be the signs you're seeing, double, triple numbers. So always look them up, um, you know, to see what they mean. Now, um, Capricorn just did their reading. They got these two same cards. So maybe check that reading out um, if, you, if you're dealing with a Capricorn or if you have Capricorn in your chart in particular. Okay, Aquarius, so I hope you've enjoyed this reading. Please do comment if it resonates. Thank you again for your support. Sending lots of love and I'll see you soon.